for everybody. Like you got the old covenant, then you got the new covenant. But if, to, to be a part of the new covenant, you got to be a part of the old. If it was just Gentile, then there would just be covenant. It would be new covenant. You got Exodus 24. Yeah, read verse seven. Exodus 24 verse 7. Uh -huh. He took the book of the covenant. He took the book of the covenant. Read. And read in the audience of the people. Okay. And said, okay. And they said, all that the, 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 the Lord has said, uh -huh. we will do and be obedient. See that we made an agreement with the Most High in that day, saying, hey, all the words, all the commandments that you told us to do, Moses, we're going to do it. So that was the covenant. Keep on reading. And Moses took the blood and sprinkled it on the people. Okay, he took the blood, now it's a covenant, right? And said, Behold, the blood and covenant to the Lord have made with you concerning all these words. Okay, keep on reading. Then went up Moses and Aaron, Nadal, and Abihu, and seventy of the elders of Israel. Okay. And they saw the God of Israel. Okay. And there was under his feet as it were a prayed work of a shot by a stone. Okay. And as it were the body of heaven in his See that? That was a covenant with Israel. That's what that only, only, the only way you're gonna be a part of the new covenant, get that in uh Jeremiah. Yeah, yeah, 31. Okay, so these are the uh man-made religions that our people are in. Like when tomorrow they're gonna go to church on Sunday, right? When that's a sin against God, we're supposed to be keeping the Sabbath. This is the seventh day of the week, which is today. Okay, it's from Friday sundown to Saturday sundown. So until you see the sun at nighttime, right, it's still the Sabbath. It's from evening to evening. Okay, now you got Islam. This is what our people mainly into. Okay, they don't even know it's started by the uh, so-called white man. Okay, I think his name is William Farb or something like that. Yeah, do you hear? He was on. Yeah, yeah, he was on that Malcolm X movie. But uh, go ahead. Jeremiah chapter 31, verse 31. Now this is the covenant that the Most High made with the children of Israel, the new covenant. But it's prophesied in the prophet Jeremiah in the Old Testament. We Behold, the day comes in the Lord that I will make a new covenant with the house of Israel and with the house of Judah. You see that? Where, where do you get all nations in there? Now again, there in Hebrews, you know, 8, 8. eight. Yeah, we'll do this in the New Testament. Let's see if it's a change. Because they say the New Covenant or the New Testament changed everything. But we just read a prophecy in the book of Jeremiah because a prophet foretells something that's going to come to pass. They just don't talk like how uh, 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 Elijah Muhammad, what his name is? Yeah, my, what his name is? Uh, we, it's in Hebrew chapter 8, verse 8. For uh, mine and fought with them, okay. he said, Behold, okay. the day comes in the Lord, okay. when I will make a new covenant with the house of Israel uh -huh. and with the house of Judah. So we just read that in the Old Testament. So where's the change? Okay. So, brother, do you know what sin is according to the Bible? What is it? Unrighteousness. But where would you classify it? What's the biblical definition? If somebody asks you, hey, brother, what is sin? But we don't get that. Get that. First John three four. First John three verse four. Who so committed? Who so ever committed sin? Transgression also the law. So sin is the transgression of the law. We for sin the transgression of the law. Okay. So that's the transgression of the law. So if how how are our people repenting if they don't know God's law? You know what I'm saying? They say I repented already, but they still in sin because they don't know the law. Okay. Get that in uh. Uh, first John 2 and 3. So many people say, oh, I know that. I got a personal relationship with him. But they ain't keeping law number one. Okay. You know what I'm saying? That's why we're in the Bible. Look, look at your people. That's because they're breaking the law. They didn't know today was the Sabbath. They're lost. Okay. They're supposed to be worshiping the most high on this day. Read. First John 2 and 3. And hereby we do know that we know him. If we keep his commandment, huh? He didn't say I know him and keep it not his commandment. Is a liar, and the truth is not in him. So the so truth is not in that man if he ain't keeping no commandments. So we are here keeping the commandments. Our people supposed to be keeping the commandments. So when they see us, they know they ain't the Mr. Sin, but in their mind they've been brainwashed. They say, Oh, I'm covered and washed under the blood, right? Christ died so I can continue a sin. Get that in the. Uh, 
Galatians 2 and 7. Because they think Christ is the minister of sin. Now, if I die, now you can just do what you want. Okay? The grace is the time to get yourself right. We're going to get that too with grace. Yeah. It's in Galatians chapter 2 verse 7. But culture-wise, when they saw that the gospel of uncircumcision was committed to me as the gospel of the circumcision was unto Peter. For he that walked effectually in Peter to the apostleship of the circumcision, the same was mighty in me uh -huh. for the Gentiles. Okay. And when James, Cyprus, I mean, uh, yeah, Cyprus, and John, who seemed to be pillars, received the gospel that was given to me, uh -huh. they came to me, and Barnabas, uh, not Barnabas, the uh -huh. right hand of fellowship that we should go to the heathen, and they unto the circumcision. Okay. Only they would that we should remember the poor, the same which I also was for to do. Okay. But when Peter was called to Antioch, I was stood him to the faith because he was to be blamed. Okay. For by that servant came from James, he did eat with Gentiles, but when they were come, he withdrew and separated himself, fearing them which are of the circumcision. So he separated himself from them, from unclean. Okay? So we supposed to be uh, keeping the law. Let me read it. Let's see, where it says, uh, 17. Yeah, 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 yeah. 17. I mean, 17. Read. Read. Galatians chapter 2, verse 17. Okay. But if, that is the far one to get. But if while we seek to be justified by Christ, we ourselves also are found sinners. Is therefore quite the minister of sin? God forbid. See that? He's not the minister of sin. So where is this gospel that they're teaching our people that Christ died so we can just stay in our sin? Okay. You see, Romans chapter 6, verse 1. What shall we say then? Shall we continue in sin that grace may abide? God forbid. So God forbid. We, how shall we that are dead to sin? Live any longer therein. So how are we gonna live long? Get that in um, what is it, Acts three seventeen? How are we gonna live longer when we know we got a judgment day coming? You know, you think you're gonna just do anything you want? Cause think about it, you had uh the days of Noah, right? Right, Noah was teaching them repent, turn from your wickedness. They didn't want to listen. Then you had Solomon and Gomorrah, right? All that, right? Now this is gonna happen again. Read. You see, Acts chapter 3, verse 7, verse 19. Repent, ye devil, and be compared, okay. that your sin may be dotted out, okay. and the time of refreshing shall come from the presence of the Lord. See that? So, that time is judgment day. So, we got we to gotta repent. You know what I'm saying? They're not teaching this in the Christian church. Okay? They're not teaching this in the Christian church. They're teaching us God is love, because it's doing what we want. We can just drive in our car, shine for God. Like, what are they going to do when they shut all the stores down? Yeah, it's coming. America don't have law. Okay? You think you're just going to continue breaking God's laws? They did it back in Jeremiah's time, right? Breaking God's laws, Jeremiah prophesied there's going to be famine in the land, right? They didn't want to listen. Yeah. So this is what we put Ezekiel 3 and 7. This is why we out here. We supposed to be corrupting our people. They see the light. They see us out here. Where, where, they, where, where they pass is at? Where pass the porch up at? He all about money. He's going to get there too. Man. They did it in the Old Testament too. Yeah. This is Ezekiel chapter 3, verse 17. Okay. Son of man, okay. I have made me a black man to the house of Israel. Okay. Therefore, he will word at my mouth okay. and give him warning for me. Keep on reading. When I say unto the wicked, okay. thou shalt surely die, okay. and thou givest him not warning, okay. nor speaking to warn the wicked okay. from his wicked way, uh, to save his life. To save who life? Right? To save his life. Okay. The same wicked man okay. shall die in his iniquity, but his blood will require at thy hand. See that? So a lot of our brothers are dying because they're not telling other brothers, hey, brother, you brother, we need to change your life. Right? Now, what's the rule that a lot of these gay men, oh, no snitching? Get down to Leviticus chapter 5 and 1. They don't know. They're breaking the law. 
So did you know, you don't, let's say you witness a crime. You went to somebody, went to somebody's house, stole something, or somebody got murdered, and you didn't say nothing, right? So you think the most high just gonna give you a pass? No. We're gonna read the law. Read. This is Leviticus chapter 501. Okay. And if a soul sin, okay. and hear the voice of swearing, okay. and is a witness whether he has seen or know of it, okay. if he do not utter it, he don't, he don't, he don't speak don't, on it, he don't, don't tell the police about it, read. He shall bear his own iniquity. He's going to bear his iniquity. He's going to get the same judgment that he witnessed. So a lot of people crying over this and hustle. They crying over these rappers, right? But these rappers have been witnesses and known the crime of murders, robberies. They didn't say anything. They didn't. Yeah. So they didn't, they didn't say anything. So I'm just going to let them pass. No, I'm going to get you where you don't expect it. Give me a Joe uh, chapter 4. Same verse. Yeah. yeah, a lot of people just reserve. They don't have no hope. They just gonna stay in the go to church, and then it's gonna be a time where they're gonna be resurrected in the fire. Or they're gonna be in the judgment seat too. This is Joel chapter four verse six. Okay. It's not it's not fear, thy confidence, thy hope, and thy uprightness uh -huh. of thy ways. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Remember, I pray who ever perished the innocent, or war, and war of the righteous cut off. Okay. Even as I have seen, they that plow in iniquity and so wickedness reap the same. So you reap the same. If you see wickedness and you plow it, you in the field doing wickedness, drug dealing, pimping out your women, doing all that, it's going to come back on you. It may not come on you. At the time, it may come 10 years later, 20 years later, 30 years later, or 40 years later, or maybe in the next life. So then, oh, that's in the command. We come back on this earth. We, we, we come back on this earth over and over. Get that in uh, the commandments. Well, he's going to show favor to those that love him and keep his commandments. That's why people uh, have certain uh, illnesses, sicknesses, they born with certain defects. Because they were breaking God's laws in times past. So they may think they got away with it. But I'm going to get you in the next life. Right? If I don't get you in this, I'm going to get you in the next. Like little babies been born. you like, man, the baby, how the baby died like that? They've been here before. Read. This is Exodus chapter 20, verse 5. Okay. Thou shalt not bow down thyself to, to them, nor serve them. Okay. For I, the Lord thy God, am a jealous God. Okay. Visiting the iniquity okay. of the fathers upon the children uh -huh. unto the third and fourth generation okay. of them that hate me, uh -huh. and showing mercy unto thousands of them that love me and keep my commandments. So we supposed to show the most out that we love him by what? Keeping the commandments. Okay, we can't say I love God, but I'm an adulterer. I can't say I love God and I'm smoking cigarettes. When that's killing. Because uh, smoking cigarettes, dark and black in your lungs, right? Because he made your body. You didn't make your body yourself. You're going against the Creator. He said, I want you to have life. But you said, no, I'm just going to smoke because I'm going through stress. There's other ways behind it. You can drink tea. You can drink other things that can relax you. Right? You know what I mean? This right here is going to get you the highness that you want. But they want the physical, which going to destroy them. Yeah. Okay. Our people know it's the Sabbath, but hey, they don't care. Read. This is Romans chapter 8, verse 12. Okay. Therefore, brother, we are helping not to the flesh to live out of the flesh. Uh -huh. For if we live out of the flesh, okay. we shall die. But if we through the spirit who modify the deeds of the body, uh -huh. we shall live. You see that? Isn't that a uh, second piece of chapter 6? Yeah. Six and twelve. Which one? The white guy? Oh, that newspaper. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, right. Yeah, they, that's, yeah, they're breaking the law. I'm going to get that law too that they break. You got it? Ephesians 6 and 12. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is, this is what we wrestling with, brother. brother. This is not a uh, physical fight, but this is a spiritual fight. Read. Ephesians chapter 6 verse 12, uh -huh. for we wrestle not against 
flesh and blood, okay. but against principality, against powers, against the rulers of darkness of this world, uh -huh. against spiritual wickedness uh -huh. in high places. See that spiritual wickedness in high places. Okay. Why do you think they promote all our people to do wickedness? They got our women dressed like whores, right? They got our brothers always being players. What's that movie called? How to be a player, right? They, why he, why he come out of the movie, husband and wife or something like that? They got to have how to be a player, uh, 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 players club, right? It's the same pattern. You know and, and our people gravitate to it because Ice Cube, oh, Ice Cube directing it. Who cares? You know what I'm saying? Ice Cube is the one that got us into that gangster stuff because when he came out with NWA, niggas with attitude. Huh? Yeah, a lot of death went behind that. A lot of brothers lost their lives. Yeah, man, that was in the newspaper and everything, man. But our people have been so spiritually sleep that they look at a black face on it, but it's really it's founded by a so-called white man. And they look at that movie, uh, Malcolm X, they have his picture, uh, Elijah Muhammad's movie have his picture above like the fireplace in the uh, movie scene, in the Malcolm X movie. Yeah, it's right there in your face. <laughs> it's in Jeremiah chapter 803, huh? and death shall be chosen rather than life, for huh? all the rest do of them that remain of this evil family, huh? which remain, in all the places where I have driven them, said the Lord of hope. Moreover, thou shalt say unto them, thus said the Lord, shall they fall and not rise? Shall he turn away and not return? Why then did this people of Jerusalem slide back by a perpetual black backsliding? They have hold fast to see they refuse to return. See that they refuse to return to the Lord. Now we don't get about this line past uh, Jeremiah 23 and 1. And then you're going to drop down a little bit to 21. Because they don't come out here because when we come out with the truth, they're going to run. Because they, they know they can't deal with it. So it's best for them to stay in that building. Okay, you can talk all high and mighty, the law saying it's hot. Right? All you want in that building, or you come out to these streets, you're going to get found out alive. But people gonna have questions. Where, where the white man at in it? You know what I'm saying? We've been told lies. Where the answer's at? We. It's in Jeremiah 23, verse 1. Woe be unto the pastor that destroy and scatter the sheep of my pastor, said the Lord. He said, destruction be unto these pastors that scatter the sheep. Now drop down to 21. Verse 21. I have not sent these prophets, yet they ran. I have not spoken to them, yet they prophesied. See, most I ain't prophesying to tell them anything because why? He's not dealing with them. But our people been bamboozled. Go to uh, Micah uh, 3 and 11. Because our people are smitten with madness. They think they the prophets of the Lord because they got the jet. They got the big uh, church building with gold ceilings, right? But they get that from y'all. <laughs> they ain't get that from God. They got, y'all got that. Uh, we gonna get that too. Y'all think ties is money. Ties is actually Crops, vegetables, wine, incense, that's time. Yeah. It's in Micah chapter 3, verse 11, uh -huh. verse 10. Uh -huh. They fill up Zion with blood and Jerusalem with iniquity. Uh -huh. The head thereof judge for war, and the priests thereof teach for hire, and the prophets thereof divine for money. Yet will they lean upon the Lord. And say it's not the law among us. Uh -huh. None evil can come unto uh, uh, upon us. Okay. See that? That's what they think. They're like, hey, ain't the Lord with us? We rich. We got the money. We got the publicity. You know what I'm saying? We got our people following after us. But God said, hey, with y'all. We got the music. But matter of fact, what was what was Christ's job on this earth? Wasn't he a carpenter? Was Peter a fisherman? These was regular men. Doing regular things. They're not going to be in Hollywood all in the movies. They're going to be about their people, about their nation. Okay, get that in the prophecy of uh, Matthew 1 and 21. Because Christ only died for his people. He ain't died for everybody. Matthew 1 verse 21. Uh -huh. And she shall bring forth a son, uh -huh. and thou shalt call his name Jesus. Uh -huh. For he shall save his people from their sins. So who is the only people that has committed sin? The children of Israel. 
Uh, give me uh, Psalms 147, uh, what, 19? Yeah, yeah. they was the one only giving the law. So the Chinese man, the white man, the Arab man, the African man, they have nothing to do with this Bible. Right now they don't, but when we rule, they will have something to do with this Bible. Because they're going to have to keep the laws that we're keeping, or else they're going to get put to death. Psalm 147, verse 18, okay. he sent it out his word okay. and melted it. Okay. He called it his wind to flow okay. and the waters to flow. Okay. He showed his word unto Jacob, okay. his statues and his judgment unto Israel. Okay. He have not dealt so with any nation. Oh, he, he ain't dealt so with any other nation, right? That's what the Bible just said. I didn't say it. This is what the Bible said. But our people brainwashing Christianity saying, oh, they been grafted in. That's not what the Bible says. We. And as for his judgments, they have not known them. Praise you, Lord. So the judgments of the Most High, they haven't even experienced it yet. Where is the white man going to slavery at in history? You don't see it. The African man, where is their history at them um, going to slavery? You don't see our people on the sign over here. Experience the uh, hardship. Get that in Deuteronomy uh, 28, verse uh, 15. Yeah. Because our people are destroyed, man. They see the prophets out here, but they don't want to change. And that's why we're going to remain here. Until, until the elect is chosen, we're going to remain in this condition. Voting is not going to help. Marching is not going to help. Joining a fraternity is not going to help. Getting a college education ain't going to help. Because we got all type of degrees. But yet, you still work for the so-called white man. And religion, you still, you still follow the white man religion. Read. Yeah. This is Romans chapter 3, verse 1. Okay. What advantage then have the Jew, or what profit is there of circumcision? Okay. Much every way. Okay. Cheaply, because that unto them okay. were committed the oracle of God. See that? Keep going to read. Uh, the one I had said. Got Yeah. With Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 15, uh -huh. but it shall come to pass that thou will not hearken. Hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God to observe to do all his commandments. Okay. And his statutes I command thee this day, okay. that all these curses shall come upon me and overtake thee. Keep going. Curse shall thou be in the city, uh -huh. and curse shall thou be in the field. You see that? Curse shall thou be in the city. So every city you see our people in, we're in the ghetto. Why are we in the ghetto? Where the, where, where the, where the Chinese man ghetto at? Where the Arab man ghetto at? You can't tell me that. You got to go over in that country and say, okay, they're in the ghetto. But over here in the States, you, you can't tell me where the Arab man living at. Where the African ghetto at? Where is it at? You don't find it, but our people call themselves African when that's the name of the so-called white man. The Scipio's Africanus. And then American species is the one how you got America. So you call yourself two white men, and we know two white men can't make a baby. So who are you? Oh, I'm black. Black is the color in the crayon box. Can I go to a landmass called black? No. So who are you? You still lost. Oh, I'm going to join the crib. I'm going to join the club. I'm going to join uh, uh, all these different organizations. I'm a, I'm a Demo uh, Demo what you call it? Democrat, Republican. But you're not, you, you're trying to go all outside the Bible. Like, what's the next person trying to do, uh, oh, Dr. Say? How you got to read the Bible? What, he tell you what thing to eat, get the hell, get it He tell you what to eat, what not to eat. I don't have to go read what Dr. Say, who's a man, who's claiming to be African, right? Yeah, that's the interview. He said he was African. So why the hell I need to listen to him? Yeah, the herbal herb dude. Yeah, yeah, wicked as hell. That's why most of put him to death. You got he lived for himself. Okay. And the swine, though he could the hook and be full of footed, uh -huh. yeah, he chewed out the cud. Okay. He is unclean unto you. See that? The pork was unclean. Go down to where they got the uh, the fish in there. And that's why I'm 14. Go down. These shall you eat of all that in the water. Okay. Whatsoever have fins and scales in the, in the water, in the sea, and in the rivers, them uh -huh. shall you eat. See that? You're supposed to be eating things that got both. Fins and scales. Crabs. Do they have fins and scales? No. But our people eat it. You know, lobsters. They don't have that. Right? 
that uh, catfish only have what? Fin. They don't have scales. So when we eat these things, we wind up in the hospital. That's why we rate the highest uh, diabetes, high blood pressure, gout, or even that movie Soul Food, right? You have Soul Food. And the mother, what happened to her? The she grandmother, died. big mother. She died. She died. She, died. she had to get her leg amputated. She eating all that bad food. And who, and who kept the tradition alive after she passed away? Her children. Her children. So what, that's why we in the same boat. So when you see Christianity, we're following the ways of our fathers. Okay? Which is which? Because we thought you were going back to the Bible. Okay? Get that in uh, Jeremiah 16 and 10. Because sometimes when the children of Israel wake up out of their sleep, hey, sisters, y'all ain't seeing. Y'all supposed to be in dress. Okay? Y'all not supposed to be in pain. Okay? That's an abomination against God. Okay? Put on some dresses. Okay? Come out that spirit. Come out that lesbian spirit. Okay? Everybody, he's supposed to like that. <laughs> 16, 10, that old beauty, he's saying yes, sir. 16, 10. The Jeremiah from 16, 13. Okay. When he shall come to pass, when thou shalt see these people, all these words, and they shall say unto thee, Wherefore have the Lord begotten all these great people against us, or what is our iniquity, or what is our sin, and we are committed against the Lord our God. So that's what we say in these last days. Why are we in this state? Because we fell into sin. So what's going to get us out of this condition? Coming back to the law, statutes, and commandments of this Bible. Because everybody got this book at the house. Everybody got the Holy Bible at the house. Then when they go to church on Sunday, everybody confused now. Isaiah 29, verse 11, verse 13. For the Lord has poured out on you the spirit of deep sleep and have closed your eyes, the prophets and your rulers, the seal have he covered, and the vision of all is become unto you as the word of a book that is sealed, which means delivered to one that is learned, saying, read this, I pray thee, and he said, I cannot, for it is sealed, and the book is delivered to him that is not learned, saying, read this, I pray thee, and he said, I am not learned. Yeah, another piece of Revelation 1 and 3. So our people don't want to read. Okay, the Bible says, blesses the man that read it. Okay, if you don't read anything, how are you going to know anything? You don't go to school without reading. So if you want to gain knowledge from the most high, you got to read the Bible. That's what people don't read. They think the white right like that brother right in the car. Oh, the white man wrote that book. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, he believed Rastafari in this. When that's the Ethiopian. I'm like, that ain't your people. It makes no sense. Yeah. It's a real legend chapter 3, chapter 1, verse 3. Blessed he that read it, and they that hear the words of his prophecy, and keep those things which are written therein, for the time is at hand. See, the time is at hand. So his Rastafari in this, his Islam, his Christianity, it's not going to hold weight on Judgment Day. Because those are all man-made religions. And our people know this, but they ain't going to hold on to it. Because it's something that feels good. Because on tomorrow, they're going to be playing the music. For two to three hours. And the prophet, or so-called prophet, pastor, he's going to be teaching John 3.16. That's it. Close the book. Hey, I remember back in my day when this and this happened. That's it. They sow a seed, pass the ties around. Let's give it ties here, Deuteronomy 14, uh, 22. Because people think ties is money. Okay, y'all been lied to again. You've been lied about the Sabbath. You've been lied about the ties. You've been lied about your religion. Yeah, you've been lying about your religion because they think because a black face guy talking. Oh, I'm not, I'm not serving the white man. <laughs> yeah. Deuteronomy chapter 14, verse 22. Thou shalt tru truly tie all the increase of thy seed that the field bring forth year by year. That the field bring forth year by year. And thou shalt keep before. Hold on, hold on. You supposed to eat time? Oh, I thought you were supposed to. I thought you were supposed to spend it. I thought we had to go to the ATM machine inside the church. 
right, and get past his times, but it's a you're supposed to eat your time from the field now. Got it? And thou shalt eat before the Lord thy God in the place where he shall choose place his name, the time of the corn, of thy wine, and of thy oil, and the firstling of thy herd, and of thy flock. Thou shalt, thou mightest learn to fear the Lord thy God always. So we supposed to fear God always. Let's get that to wisdom, Psalms uh, 110 and 11. Because the fear of the Most High is the beginning of wisdom. Okay, you're not going to have wisdom if you're just doing your own pleasure. Because you're going to get messed up. You're going to get the wrong type of woman. Right? You see how his wife feels over there? Obedient, nice, calm, collective. You can't get these sisters out here to do that. You tell his sister to be quiet. You can't tell me what to do, I ain't got to listen to you. That's what they say, right? Read. It's so funny enough, on the the fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom, uh, a good a understanding, a good understanding uh, has all faith that do his commandments, uh, pray, his praise and do it forever. See that? Praise and do it forever. It's not something temporary. It's not just, oh, that's the old test. We ain't got to do that. Now. What scripture is that? Show me a precept where it says you can break his commandments. Then I pack up my book and I leave. Like the brother, sponsor, Selassie, yeah, whatever that thing is, Rastafarianism, but he ain't come over here. <laughs> Why, if that's the true doctrine, come over here. But he can't do it. It's not going to hold up weight. But the Bible said prove all things, right? Get that, get that. First Thessalonians 5. Yeah, you got you to prove all things, man. You can't just come out with running your mouth. You know, that's what they have to do in the Christian church. We in the Christian church, we about Hebrew Israel. We got, uh, matter of fact, we got feast days that we're supposed to be doing, like the Passover, right? Feast of eleven bread, first fruit. You know what I'm saying? Not no Easter, not no uh, birthday, not no Christmas. Where are these things at in the Bible? Bunny rabbit laying eggs. Come on, man. This is what we hold on to, little kitty stuff, man. Read. This is First Thessalonians chapter 5, verse 2 and 1. Okay. Prove all things. Okay. Hold fast that which is good. See that? The Bible said prove all things. things. So where is your Christian pastor to prove Christianity at? I haven't seen that one pastor on the street since we've been out here. You know what I'm saying? I've seen more women possibly out here. Like, matter of fact, Jehovah's Witness. Oh, that's all people I see. They come to your house. But who they got on the face of the image? White man. Where you at in that? Just don't want to be found. Rabbits lay eggs. I thought rabbits have babies like humans. No. Rabbits lay eggs. Yeah, they do. No, rabbits don't lay eggs. I know it. I know. <laughs> yeah, dude yeah, says rabbits don't lay eggs. Y'all got your college degree. I ain't got no college degree. I ain't got no college degree. But y'all celebrate easy. Make some sense. Uh, they worship the goddess uh, Isatar, like the multiple breasts, yeah, multiple breasts, or whatever like that. The, the goddess of fertility, basically. That's why you got the little kids, they gravitate little kids around it, because it's the goddess of fertility. But they covered it up and made it all, it's about the kids. So. Olympians chapter 4, verse 8, finally, bro, whatsoever things are true, whatsoever things are honest, Whatsoever things are just, whatsoever things are pure, whatsoever things are lovely, whatsoever things are good, or if there be any virtue, and if there be any praise, think on these things. See that? You know, uh, what is it? Whatever. Verse, what is that? Verse, chapter 4, 4, and 11. First Peter, 4, and 11. Yeah, because our people are brainwashed, man. Celebrating these pagan holidays. We supposed to be keeping the Passover. Okay? Y'all supposed to be re uh, repentant. Coming back to God's law, statutes, and commandments. Read. This is for preaching the four verses of God. If any man speak, let him speak as the oracle of God. Okay. If any man minister, let him do it as of the ability which God has given. That God in all things may be glorified through Jesus Christ, to whom we pray and dominion. 
forever and ever. See that? Supposed to do everything according to the scriptures. You gotta come out the Bible. Ask your pastor, come out the Bible. I'm tired of hearing you talk. Come out the Bible. Get that with Dream of Dream. We don't hear Martin Luther King Jr. out the Bible. That's a chair about Trump Because MLK was in there, he got his judge. If you keep on reading, he get to, he's gonna put him to death. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he ain't read that. MLK should have read that. Like, hold up. If I say that, I'm gonna get put to death. If I come out and say, I have a dream, I have a dream, and it's false, most I gonna put me to death. Jeremiah 23, verse 23. Yeah, 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 nah, 25. I have heard what the prophet have said and prophesied lies in my name, uh -huh. saying, I have a dream, I have a dream. Uh -huh. How long shall this be in the heart of the prophet and prophesied lies? Uh -huh. Yet they are prophesied, the prophet of the seat of, of their own heart. Uh -huh. They think to call our people to forget my name by their dreams, which they tell every man to his neighbor, as their fathers have forgot my name. For all, the prophet that have a dream, let him tell a dream, and he that have my word, let him speak my word faithfully, huh? which is the, the chain to the weak, huh? said the Lord. See that? They get to the devil. I don't see how long, though. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Verse 26, how long shall this be in the heart of the prophet that prophesied a lie? Yet they, have, they are prophets of the seat of, of their own heart, uh -huh. which things to cause my people to forget my name uh -huh. by their dreams, which they tell every man to his neighbor, and as their father have forgotten my name for Paul. So our people have forgotten the Most High's name. Okay, they forgot these scriptures. Okay, they follow a man. That's why they celebrate MLK Day. Okay, they do everything. Matter of fact, they like they allow school off on that day, right? So they put it as a national holiday, but nobody ain't doing no commandment. You know what I'm saying? So that's why we are here to get people edification, so they be ready on Judgment Day. Get that in uh, Daniel seven and nine, because you you wanna know if the Most High is a black man, right? Or he just a puff of smoke like they be teaching in Christianity, like they say, oh, he don't have a body, right? Yeah. Yeah, he, yeah, he all yeah, 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 he all colors. That's what they say, right? Rainbow. He's the rainbow. All right. <laughs> yeah. This is Daniel chapter seven verse nine. I consider the horn. I beheld when the throne was cast down, uh -huh. and the ancient of day he is sick, uh -huh. whose garment was white as snow, uh -huh. and his hair over his head like a pure wood. Uh -huh. His nose was like a fiery flame, uh -huh. and his wheel that burned in fire. A fiery screen issued and came forth from before him. So, so they have seen a fiery flame of fire bestowed uh, in front of the Most High. Read. Ten, oh, on, a fiery screen issued and came forth before him. Thousand, thousand ministered to him, and ten thousand times ten thousand stood before him. The judgment was set and the book was open. See that? That's, that's a future prophecy. That ain't even happened yet. <laughs> so, so, so right now, they can have them, they can put their music, they can turn up, right? But that day, they're going to be ministering unto him. What did he say? Ministering to him? They're ministering to him, the Most High. The ancient of days. I didn't have enough time. I, 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 I wish I could, nah. Yeah, he said the judgment said the books are open. This holy Bible. Their life got to match over this book to make it in the kingdom. Okay, okay, let's do that. Uh, get that in uh, Revelation 14 12. A lot of people think they can just make it out of just love. Oh, I love you, brother. That's all I got to do. 14 12. Yeah, 14 12. You know what I mean? Your work is uh, what we're doing right now. This is our work. Right? This is what the disciples are doing. This is what the prophets are doing. So, yeah, yeah. Revelation chapter 14, verse 12. Uh -huh. Here is the passion of the saints. Here are they that keep the commandments of God and the faith of Jesus. So you gotta have both. You gotta have faith in Jesus and keep the commandments. You can't have one way or the other. The most people say, I believe in God. Get that in uh, Sirach 
32 and 24. And they were like, oh, I believe. Believe is the action word, right? Like that song called, I believe y'all can fly, right? You know, many people say, I believe in this. And they do it. Like, they believe in Islam, but they can't prove nothing out of Islam. I did ask them, brother, show me a prophecy that, uh, in the Quran. They can't show me. This is a rock to the 32 24. He that believes in the Lord, taking heed to the commandment, and he that trusted in him, in him, shall fare never the way. See that? He that believes in him, gonna do, take heed. They gonna do it. They gonna do the commandments. So what's gonna make us uh, perfect, brother? What's gonna, what's gonna change our condition? Is it just voting, marching, rapping, getting a record deal? What is, what we gotta do as people? That you know all this information. Come together under what, though? Under one God, but uh, doing what? But many people say, keeping the commandments. Keeping the commandments, yeah. You can't come together with killers. You can't, come, you can't come together with these people because they're going to try to bring white man Jesus in there. We the Psalm 119, verse 59. Uh -huh. I thought on my way uh -huh. and turned my feet unto thy testimony. Uh -huh. I made haste uh -huh. and delayed not uh -huh. to keep thy commandment. So they would say he made haste to keep the commandment. He ain't, he ain't put off. Give me that in uh, Sarah 5 5. Because most people. They are put off every day. They know they're Hebrew Israelites, but they're like, I, I got plenty of time to change. Most people don't got that much time. You may die tomorrow. A lot of, a lot of time it happens like that. They get in their car, they did. Yeah, like you think we just out here. We're going to prove that the most awesome is out here. No matter if they want to stop the world from coming out with a security guard. But we're going to teach the world regardless. We, we surrounds the five or two, uh -huh. follow not thy own heart, okay. Okay. follow not thy own mind, okay. and thy strength to walk in the way of thy heart, uh -huh. and say not, who shall control me for my word, for the Lord will surely obey thy pride. Okay, that's the right time. Uh, uh, uh. Verse five, chapter five, verse five, concerning for reputation, be not without fear to add sin unto sin. See that? We're not supposed to add sin to sin. Right? That's what they do in Christian church, right? They add sin to sin. Right? You got the women in there, got blonde hair in the head. You're not supposed to have that in your head. Get that law. You know what I'm saying? Leviticus 13 30. That's against God's law. Okay? You're supposed to have your natural woolly hair, right? That's your hair in your head. Not no white doggy stringy hair. Wait. Wait. Leviticus in the 13th verse 30. Then the priest shall see the plague, uh -huh. and behold, it be in the sight deep within the skin, uh -huh. and there be in a yellow thin hair. A yellow thin what? Yellow thin hair. Okay. Then the priest shall pronounce him unclean. Then is a dry star, even a leprosy upon the head of the or beard. And if the priest look upon the plague of the star, and behold, it be not in the sight deep within in the skin, uh -huh. and there, there is no black hair in it. There be no what? No black hair in it. Uh -huh. Then the priest shall shake up him that have the plague of the star seven days. See that? It's a curse to have that different color hair in your head. Yeah, it must be black, dark color, not yellow. Or what's the other color? They crazy blue, purple, red, all that. Huh? Green. Green. How people going, man? But it'll say they crazy. Yellow. <laughs> Yellow. Okay. <laughs> they crazy. Yeah, they be all type of colors. Like they, I don't know, man. They gone. What's up with yellow? Yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. Why you got one of them? They be black, man. They be green. They hate themselves so much. It's self hate. Because they don't know they're great people. You might do it on the 76. They don't know they're the holy people, man. See, they look at us and mock us. Oh, they talk about the Bible. Ah, oh, we ain't got this nigga. Right? That's what they think. We just see more white. Wait, hey, wait, wait. Little pussy, they was over here. They a flock over here, man. This place is going back, man. Wait, wait. Well, we we gonna be righteous in that day. They gonna be flocking to us in that day. This is Drew Rodman chapter 7, verse 6. Uh -huh. For thou and holy people unto the Lord thy God. Uh -huh. The Lord thy God hath chosen me to be a special people unto himself uh -huh. above all people.
open. See that? You see how they slow down? See, you see, usually on Saturdays, they be packed out, right? Look, look, look at it. Look at the parking lot. And they know they ain't seeing. They would just be camped out, chilling, smoking. Oh, they see a prop sign. They got to go. They gotta get, I, 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 can't, I can't stay here long. <laughs> yeah, they got to go. Too much Bible out there, man. <laughs> they got to go. Yeah, you know, you know what I'm talking about. They be, they be packed on Saturday. But when the Bible come out, oh, I got to go. This is John chapter 3. Verse 19, uh -huh. and this is the condemnation that light is coming to the world, uh -huh. and men know darkness rather than light, uh -huh. because their deeds were evil. Their deeds were what? Because their deeds were evil. So their deeds are evil. We, or everyone that doing evil, hate the light. Now I come to the light, which his deeds should be reproved, but he that doing truth, coming to the light, that his deeds may be manifested that they are loving in Elohim. See, yeah, we're not supposed to be lovers of the world, too. That's what our people are. They love this world. Get at uh, 1 John 2 and 15. We're not supposed to be lovers of this world. You're supposed to be opposite of this world. You're not supposed to be mimicking the rock right entertainment. They see us. They know who we are. They know we about this work. You know what I'm saying? They know they don't see it. We. John 2 verse 15. Lord, not the world. No, we're supposed to love the world because it's John 3, 16. So, 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 so love the world, right? Uh, it's, some, it's a contradiction now. The Bible makes sense now. He said love not the world. But, yeah, I love the world, but it's not the same meaning. It's two different meanings. We love not the world. Not the things that are in the world. If any man love the world, the love of the Father is not in him. See that the love of the Father is not in you if you love the world. Okay? You're not supposed to be buying on the Sabbath, but the Sabbath is pretty much over right now because the sun is down. Okay? So just in case you didn't know, okay? Now you know. They don't want to listen to the Bible. But when they, all these stores get closed down, they can't, they can't feed their families, they're going to be crying out to God in that day. Right like, now, they ain't going to do it. They comfort. Okay? They comfort, right? In uh, John 17 and 9. Because Christ said, love not the world. Huh? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I feel you, man. I feel you. Yeah, yeah, you good. Uh, one more scripture, bro. In John 17, verse 9. Huh? I pray for them. I pray not for the world, huh? but for them which thou hast given me, for they are thine. So the most I gave Christ the children of Israel. That's who he's praying for. That's the world. They get one more, one more. Uh, you know, you know what I want. The world. Yeah, that's yeah. the Yep. Yeah. We're going to prove that the world that Christ was quoting, he was just quoting Isaiah. Okay, and then he was talking to another Israel. He was talking to a Chinese African man when he said that, John 3. He said, Isaiah 35, verse 17. For Israel shall be saved in the Lord with the everlasting salvation. You shall not be ashamed, nor confound you, world without end. See that world without end. That's the world. Israel is the world without end. That's what's going to be saved. We're going to be saved because we're the only ones in captivity. Okay? You know what I'm saying? So a lot of our people, they don't even know they're in slavery still. So who, who they work for at the end of the day? They work for the white man. The same man that put them in slavery. Yeah, hand that out to the other people. Right, see, the curses. We got another choir. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, let me give you this. See that? That's the high holy days right here that we're supposed to be keeping. So if pastor try to come up to you, you be like, hey, man, you're not even keeping the, high, the holy days. 